and they were your first two Premier League goals for us. Are you looking forward to looking back and watching them all over again? Yeah, I haven't seen them in a long time. I know sometimes we sort of, um, maybe before a big game or if we're looking at um, historical moments um, of us in the Premier League, at, from time to time they do pop up and it is always nice seeing them. But yeah, it's always nice to see them. I'm not yeah. sure if maybe they fought, you know, 2-0 up, warm up, we've won the game and maybe they, they took their foot off the gas a bit. But um, we obviously went hell for leather. Um, starting with Smudge's strike, um, which I think gave us even more belief than we had that we can get back into it. And we kept fighting. Um, I think I moved from out wide. I think Gaffer put me in the middle, actually. Um, and then, yeah, the first one, the ball broke to me and I got uh, probably a bit lucky with, with the goal. Um, and then even after that, you know, when they went down down the other end right at the end of the game and scored, um, to me, my feeling looking back on the game, I, I didn't really... F- feel that the game was over I thought we had one more chance than us or, or something can go our way and obviously it turned out um, the perfect cross from Chaz Smudge was positive and I was on the end of it so everything worked out and it was a header as well and even in the commentary they say it's Tony Gale who says he's, he remembers you at West Ham and he hasn't seen you score many headers many I, I think until this day I don't think I've scored one before it or after it <laughs> I'm not sure. I know I got a few when I was younger, um, but I can't actually remember any in in first team action other than that one. So I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. Is it just the reaction thing and just trying your best to get it on target? Yeah, it was exactly that. When first of all, it was I, I remember being like in between two defenders, um, and just before he crossed it, I remember thinking, if he can just pull it in between these two, I've got a chance. And as soon as he hit it, I saw it coming my way and I just had to just concentrate because, as you know, my headers are not are not <laughs> any good. So I thought, let me just concentrate and hit the target. And I've done it and thankfully it went in. And then after the game, what was it like? Because following on from that, we won three in a row, which really didn't cement our place in the Premier League, but it sort of showed that we belong there. Yeah, as I say, from two different halves, the first half against Everton, um, you know, we was nowhere near it. I think the second half, once we sort of took the handbrake off and played with a bit more freedom, um, we saw we got the reward from it. Um, and then obviously, I think, did we play Chelsea? Was it Chelsea away after that? Chelsea was the next one, yeah. And then Man U. When you go to Chelsea um, and you have a game plan and you execute a game plan and you, you get a win and a reward for it, um, I think it just gives you more confidence, more belief that if, if you can go away, and I think there was champions at the time, if you can mm-hmm. go away and beat the champions at their place, um, then there's no reason, you know, why another another big team can't come to your place and you can't win. Um, so I think it was just more of a, a confidence and a belief um, in those games. And yeah. I'm sure Jacob and Alex, your your twins, they'll be desperate to see him as well, or you will make them desperate to see it. Yeah, they'll see it. Don't worry, they'll see it. 